The key aims in the Africa Eco Race are cultural discovery, endurance, mutual assistance and friendliness. These are the cornerstones of those that take part in the Motul Extreme Rider category. But who are these bikers about to take on this huge challenge that will change them forever? Effectivement. As I always say, these are the modern-day knights. They will be tackling a 6,000-kilometer desert race for 15 days, alone with their trunks. Happily, they will be assisted by a team of six people this year, two dedicated lorries. They're real warriors, and I think they'll be thrilled this evening on the podium and looking forward to arriving in Dakar at Lac Rose. But what drives these riders year after year to take part in such an adventure? What gives them their enormous courage? I think there are a lot of people who have already done rally raid or enduro races and I think they want to push their limits, find new versions of themselves and measure themselves against themselves at the end of the day. And the incredible thing about the solo bikes is that it's a community. So I think that on social networks, groups, it allows them to get to know former solo riders. They get advice and then they come with their two trunks and they find out for themselves. Courage is only one requirement for this extreme undertaking. One also needs a large dose of craziness. That's for sure, but I think they're all a bit crazy. But those who do the Malmoto, they just want to confirm to themselves that they're crazy. We're not allowed to help them mechanically. The only thing they can get from our team and Motul is lubricants, cleaners, etc. And as for the team we have for them, they transport their personal equipment, the trunks, and they set up the bivouac for them. So when they arrive in the evening after the stage, they can see their own little space, their tent, their trunk, all ready to go. The Motul Extreme Rider is a special category, and so the organizing team gave it its own ranking. Exactly, and I think that's the least we can do. Alongside Motul, we launched the Motul Extreme Rider officially four or five editions ago, and now it's a category in its own right. This year, we have a dozen bikers, a little less than in previous years.